Sheikh Hamdan absent from court, hearing into Sheikh bin Tisaid welfare. The Sheikh Hamdan failed to attend the second High Court hearing into the welfare of his wife. Sheikh Hamdan, 36, is currently embroiled in a court battle with his estranged wife, Sheikh Sheikh bin Tisaid bin Tani Maktoum, 33 years old. Sheikh Sheikh bin Tisaid bin Tani Maktoum left Dubai earlier this year and has been living in London with their two friends since May. The couple married in 2019. Sheikh Hamdan didn't attend a preliminary hearing in July and was absent again from the family division of the Royal Courts of Justice in London today. Instead, he was represented by a divorce lawyer, Helen Ward, whose previous clients include ex-F1 boss Bernie Eccleston and a new addition to the Sheikh Hamdan legal team, Lord Panic. Last month, Lord Panic triumphed in the Supreme Court as he represented claimants attempted to overturn Boris Johnson's suspension of Parliament. It is usual practice in the UK family courts for both parents to attend. Sheikh Hashiga bin Tassin Bintani McTeen was president alongside uh, lawyer Fiona Shackleton who handled the divorces of Prince Charles and Lady Diana as well as Paul McGartney and Heather Mills. In July, the father and mother issued a joint statement in which they said these proceedings are concerned with the welfare of the children of their marriage and do not concern divorce or finances. Sheikh Hashiga bin Tassin Bintani McTeen has made several applications including a request for a forced marriage protection order during the July hearing. A forced marriage protection order can be made to protect the person from being forced into a marriage or from any attempt to be forced into a marriage and could, for example, prevent someone being taken abroad. The children are currently wards of the court, meaning any major decisions impacting them must be cleared by the court. Additionally, reporting restrictions are in place to protect their welfare. Only a limited number of media outlets, including Sky News, were permitted to attend the hearing. A full five-day hearing into the custody and welfare matter of the children will occur in November.